What's up guys, welcome back to my channel and finally I'm able to do another what's inside the box uh, episode right here. This is episode 10, I got one huge box right in front of me and uh, let's all find out what we got. And we're back! Yes, finally, sorry to actually like uh, I'm um, sorry that I haven't like done another what's inside the box episode. It's been a while since I got this much haul because uh, the longer I collect Funko Pops, um, the wiser I get. <laughs> I mean, what I'm trying to say is like uh, the longer I collect Funko Pops, um, uh, it's also, uh, I'm also having a realization, uh, uh, you know, I'm also having a realization when it comes to like what pops are so important to me so uh, uh, that's why um, I, it's, it took me a long time to actually release another what's inside the box episode but anyway before we get in, uh, into the box since it's a haul video might as well share with you guys my recent pickups uh, this time from our friends over at Hobby Stock uh, my pre-orders just came in like a couple of days ago and I finally got some of the missing pieces of uh, the Space Jam A New Legacy uh, line. All right, I was just I was like thinking of saving uh, this one for another episode, but I'll probably do uh, part three of the Space Jam um, Funko Pops unboxing uh, when I get the uh, sticker pops here with me. I still have them pre-ordered and didn't arrive yet. So when it does, I'll definitely do part three of that. If you missed part two, you can click the link right up there for the Space Jam unboxing episode. But anyway, I got the last, uh, not last, but uh, two new pieces to add to my collection. It is Dom uh, James right here, right? The son of LeBron uh, uh, in the movie. And of course, uh, if th for, for those of you guys who are wondering where, where Sylvester and Tweety was from uh, my uh, part two of... The unboxing video here it is it came in late uh, as usual <laughs> all right so uh, there you go uh, two more Space Jam pops for you all right and next one is a special one this is actually a new line for Funko and I really really love it it is the uh, Superman first appearance it is actually uh, um, the same as the comics this is number one the first ever uh, Superman comics uh, wherein Superman first was introduced to us and uh, uh, Funko did a pop together with the uh, comic uh, cover of it which it was like the reprint of uh, the comics but this will do all right it comes with its own acrylic um, box as well and uh, with uh, the cool looking Superman figure inside right there Awesome, awesome. I really love this. And uh, they're actually also releasing games, uh, uh, the uh, video games line as well. Uh, I want to get the Diablo 2. So I've been playing Diablo way back then. Uh, and I remember playing the game. And I think I finished the whole game as well. So I'm planning to get the uh, Diablo 2 and probably the, Son the, the Sonic the Hedgehog as well. Uh, I don't know what it's called, but I think it's Pop Games. Not really sure. But I think it uh, comes with the, the, you know, the same box as this, or maybe it's the same height as this. I'm not really sure. But this is uh, um, smaller but taller than the pop albums. So uh, there you go. It is the uh, Superman first appearance comic covers, pop comic covers line. It's number one. And this is actually the first uh, comic cover. And uh, I saw the, they're uh, also releasing Batman and some other DC heroes and probably Marvel heroes in the future as well. I don't know, but I'm just picking those uh, um, comic covers that I really, really want. But anyway, here we go. Uh, this is the main course of this episode. It, it's, it is the episode, it is the 10th episode of what's inside the box. So I got one huge box with me. And of course, this is a special box because it, it has the Target logo, Target logo, but I didn't get this from Target. I got this uh, from our friend, our good friend from Popolic. So uh, Boss Mark, thank you so much for 
uh, accommodating my pre-orders. This is these are all my pre-orders from uh, Popholic, and I definitely like uh, you like I always get them every month. There's like one box from the U.S. shipped here every month, and uh, I do have pre-orders as well. Uh, I'll definitely get another box from him next month, so probably that might be episode 11. Um, we'll see. But anyway, here it is, guys, for uh, episode 10 of What's Inside the Box. I only got one, two, three, four. You might be wondering why uh, I only got four pops, and you might be wondering why it's such a huge box. So I'll definitely show you. So first up, it is um, one of my missing pieces for my Dragon Ball Z collection. It is the Android 16 Walmart uh, exclusive right there. It is the metallic Android 16 um, exclusive to Walmart. Finally, I got it. Uh, it's uh, one of my missing pieces. Actually, my few missing pieces for my Dragon Ball Z collection uh, are with Popholic. Right? I pre-ordered all of them already from Popholic. So when everything gets here or gets to me, I'll definitely complete the uh, old and new releases for Dragon Ball Z. Aside from the hard to find stickered ones, all right. So uh, aside from that, I'll, I think I think it's safe to say I'm complete ready from the comments to the stickered ones. Um, like I said, aside from the hard to find stickered uh, Dragon Ball Z pops, I I think I'm complete. And also the Arlia Vegeta, which I don't know if it's possible. But if you guys help me reach 1,000 subscribers, no budget. It might be a possibility in the future. Who knows? But anyway. Uh, the first haul from Popholic is the Android 16 Walmart sticker. All right. Second one is uh, the Target Con exclusive Michael Jordan with the white warm-up jersey right there. It uh, it I actually placed it in a stack ready. I wanted all my MJs to be placed in a hard stack. All right. Um, I actually have the uh, out of the box version. If you guys are wondering, um, I. I Got it ready because I also have a set of Michael Jordan Funko Pops out of the box. I mean everything from the white jersey, 10 inch, red jersey, all the UNCs and all the uh, uh, the uh, Ch Chicago Bulls, Michael Jordan. I have them out of the box. I have it there as well. And uh, some of you guys have been asking me to actually do a collection reveal. When we get to 1,000 subscribers, I'll definitely show all my Funko Pops to you. Right, so help me reach 1,000 subscribers, and I'll definitely um, do a collection reveal, or probably like a tour uh, in our room, in our living room right here, where I show all of my pops to you, including all my for sale pops as well. I'm actually selling pops uh, that I don't like, um, uh, that I actually got from the mystery boxes that I'm getting. All right, so. Uh, I'll definitely show you guys. Help me reach 1,000 subscribers and uh, I'll do a collection reveal to you guys. But anyway, second haul from Pop Pollock is the Target Con stickered Michael Jordan white warm up suit. Right? I think it's the white warm up suit, right? But uh, anyway, moving on to the third one. All right, down to the last two pops right here. The third pop I got from Pop Pollock is none other than. The Morgan Stark and Tony Stark 2-pack right here. Check it out. The Glow in the Dark exclusive to Pop in the Box. It is the Pop in the Box sticker of uh, Morgan and Tony Stark pop right here. And I want to get this pop so bad because of the glow of uh, Tony Stark right here. You can follow me on Instagram. I'll post the glow shots for this probably later at night because it's still... Um, early in the afternoon here in Cebu City so when it gets dark I'll definitely do some glow shots for this uh, you can follow me on Instagram at djbrian.g so you guys can check out the picture that I took from this awesome looking glow-in-the-dark Funko Pop uh, that's uh, Morgan Stark and Tony Stark right so that's the third um, haul from Pop Pollock and lastly for the grand finale, that's why we I do have like a huge box right in front of me because of this. I got one 10 inch pop right here from Pop Pollock, and it is my first ever Stormtrooper Funko Pop as well. I've been wanting to get Stormtroopers. Um, I actually wanted to collect all the Stormtroopers, but it's just way too many 
and uh, the grails are expensive as well so I decided to just to get one 10 inch stormtrooper so here it is guys it is the uh, 10 inch stormtrooper this is the 2020 galactic convention exclusive of course it's uh, just a shared sticker right here right there I believe so right so this is the 10 inch stormtrooper and uh, as always this one uh, as always when it comes to like getting a 10 inch pop I usually take it out of the box and show you guys because uh, I also believe that 10 inch pop should be taken out of the box and should be appreciated outside of the box but I don't know I just don't have the heart yet to get all my 10 inch pops out of the box and just throw the box away <laughs> probably if I do have like a space wherein I can keep all the 10 inch boxes um, hidden all right I might consider in actually like uh, um, like taking all of them out of the box the, the pops a little bit dirty all right you got lots of dirt on the pop but anyway I think this uh, actually it still smells new so for sure this wasn't taken out of the box so uh, we got some flaws from expect some flaws by the way from Funko they can't like exactly per you know paint perfectly but anyway check it out guys my first ever stormtrooper and it's a 10 inch pop wow awesome awesome there you go let me do a slow turn of course it is a bubble head if you guys know if you're uh, if you guys don't know and if you are a, a new collector um, Star Wars figures are bubble head figures just like uh, the Marvel uh, Marvel pops as well I think and uh, some other lines uh, they do come as a bubble head but Star Wars are one of them one of the lines that uh, comes with a bubble head and it looks freaking cool see see look at that probably I can make a TikTok video with uh, the wobbly the the bubble head right there <laughs> I don't know we'll see about that but check it out guys such a cool one love this one so much uh, detail going on on the 10 inch stormtrooper and I definitely definitely love it and I'll pretty sure I, um, I'll think of uh, like uh, a shot for this as well probably might just uh, look for a perfect spot for me to take a picture of this cool looking 10 inch pop but for now uh, I'm gonna show you guys this baby out of the box all right so uh, there it is episode 10 done <laughs> hope you guys liked it uh, for sure we'll do episode 11 um, hopefully soon enough uh, I'll try to actually like ask uh, our, my friend boss mark of pop holic uh, I think I do have another box coming in uh, for the month of July and uh, probably that probably might be a good uh, candidate for episode 11 of what's inside the box but anyway that's it for now um, uh, I'm so happy with my recent hauls right here and uh, so happy as well to actually um, um, share it with you guys and bring you another episode of what's inside the box and yes I'm definitely serious if we hit 1,000 subscribers I'm gonna do like a collection tour uh, from my old uh, out of the box pops to all of my pops right here and uh, you know that my Dragon Ball Z wall is behind the camera I got my pop rocks wall right there and this is like my personal grail wall uh, behind me uh, right here and I'll definitely show you guys everything of course I do have like my Michael Jordan shelf uh, on my left and I'll definitely show you guys that as well but help me reach 1,000 subscribers all right and I'll definitely do the collection tour if ever we do and I'm hoping and praying we get to a thousand subscribers very 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 soon all right so there you go episode 11 done uh, thank you guys so much don't forget to follow me on Instagram it's at djbrian.g um, click the like and subscribe button drop a comment down below um, you know feel free to ask me whatever you wanted to ask me or if you have suggestions that you want me to do um, I'll definitely uh, try my best to actually reply to you guys right away um, uh, down in the comment section and uh, click that notification bell to get notified of my future videos thank you so much episode 10 of what's inside the box is officially over my name is Brian G and I'll definitely see you in the next one I'm out <laughs>